Hey, it's January 1st, 2016. Happy New Year, everyone. This is Jake from Polygon to talk about Xur's inventory for the weekend. Uh, if you're just picking up the game over the holidays, Xur is the exotic gear merchant in Destiny. Shows up every Friday and leaves every Sunday, uh, very early in the morning, and will appear at a random location within the tower. Sells exotic gear for the currency of strange coins, which can be picked up uh, through Crucible or through Strikes, uh, other random activities throughout the game. First up is Imperium Bellicose. This is a Titan helmet that gives you aiming weapons while airborne holds you in place. So that's similar to the Sunsinger Angel of Light perk. Uh, basically, if you jump and you hold down, you aim down the sights, you'll float for a few seconds. It's kind of niche, kind of gimmicky, but it can be fun to play with, especially in Crucible. Sealed Ahamkara Grasps. These are hunter gloves that give you an additional melee charge, and melee damage may reload your primary weapon. So if you love melee, uh, especially you know using Gunslinger, get an extra, extra uh, throwing knife. Um, that can be great, or extra smoke grenade if you're running Night Stalker. Starfire Protocol, gain an additional fusion grenade uh, charge for Warlocks. This is okay. Uh, it doesn't stack with Gift of the Sun, so you can still only have a maximum of two fusion grenades. Um, you may want to use it if you want to run uh, want to run two fusion grenades, but also have Touch of Flame, so your grenades ignite. Uh, not a huge fan of this exotic. Invective is a... Uh, year one shotgun that you used to get through exotic bounties. Uh, now it's just a random exotic. Uh, this weapon regenerates ammo over time, so it's pretty slow. I think every 30 seconds you'll get a new clip um, of four, and it's full auto. It fires very quickly, but it's a fun gun to play around with. Very powerful. And this is the Legacy Engram. So if you're new to the game, Legacy Engram is uh, going to give you a year one item. So and it's not even guaranteed that it decrypts for your class, but that's for collectors who want to round out their collection of year one exotics. Uh, it will not give you a year two value, so it's I, I advise you to stay away from it. It is not that valuable. Uh, three of coins, these are great. It's always a great way to dump strange coins if you have them. Uh, you can pop one of these before you perform any activity, so crucible or a strike, uh, and it increases your chance to get an exotic drop from the boss or from completing the crucible match. And glass needles are used for the twist fate option on exotic gear, which is uh, a way to re-roll the stats and get different random stats on your exotics. So that's it. Uh, if you're still playing Destiny, I hope you have a great 2016 of Destiny. And uh, hopefully Bungie releases some new content soon to uh, draw people back in.